Mike in Montreal 2005. A, my buddy Tim and I were killing time, enjoying the city, walking downtown, and saw this guy with the red spiky hair walking towards us, and I knew right away who it was. So did my friend. And literally when you passed us, we said, hello, Mike, and you stopped right away, said hello, guys, and we introduced ourselves, told us, we told you where we were from, Wisconsin and Minnesota. Um, we talked about the tour for a little bit. It was maybe a five minute conversation, but you made us feel we were the most important thing of your day. And uh, it was really special. We didn't have our cameras, we left them in the car. Nobody had phones or really phone cameras at the time still, pre-whatever, but I kept on thinking someone was going to come up to us while talking to you and kind of kill the moment, but that never happened, and uh, we kind of let you go because you had some bags in your hand, so you were probably shopping or something, but uh, great five-minute conversation we had, and I think we even gave you a request that I think you... I'm not sure what it was, but I think you guys did play it in Ottawa two nights later. So, um, always a fun conversation, always a fun memory to have. And the best part of that story is after we passed you, we both swear, my friend and I, that Eddie Murphy passed us the block later. So maybe we're wrong, but we both thought that and said it and talked about it later on. So who the heck knows, but we met Mike McCready and maybe Eddie Murphy too if we saw him. So anyway, you take care. Stay safe. And we'll see you down the road when this is all over with. Take care, all the best, and happy birthday again.